Botox is a brand name of which there are several different companies. The actual um, chemical is anabotulinum toxin A. This is derived from Clostridium bacteria. So it is a toxin, but it's been repurposed so that it doesn't actually cause harm to your skin and to your body. What it does is it works at your neuromuscular synapse to prevent the release of acetylcholine, which is a neurotransmitter that helps your muscles contract. So when you administer Botox, that acetylcholine transmission is halted and you can't contract those muscles to make wrinkles anymore. The right practitioner will not overdo the Botox. That's really important to do it with a gentle hand, to do it in the right places so that you avoid looking frozen. Sometimes people will ask, well, is this actually safe? Um, Botox Cosmetic was approved for cosmetic use in 2002, and so in all of this time, we have really excellent safety data, particularly for the amounts that are used in dermatology. It's been shown to be safe. The only real side effects that you might experience are some injection site reactions, a little bit of bruising, maybe some temporary swelling. Um, but otherwise, it's really well tolerated. One thing to know about it is that it does last usually about three to four months, so it does require repeated office visits. The plus side of that, though, is if you're not happy with Botox and it's not for you, it's not there forever. I'm Dr. Rina Rupani. I work with Mount Sinai doctors in Chelsea. My scope of practice includes adult and pediatric dermatology, medical, surgical, and cosmetic care, and I have a fellowship background and a particular interest in integrative medicine. I'm welcoming new patients. I'm in Manhattan. Come see me.